another short story by Tomás Rivera from his book, The Earth Did Not Devour Him. This one is called The Children Couldn't Wait. The heat had set in with severity. This was unusual because it was only the beginning of April, and this kind of heat was not expected until the end of the month. It was so hot that the bucket of water the boss brought them was not enough. He would come only two times for the midday, and sometimes they couldn't hold out. That was why they took to drinking water from the tank at the edge of the furrow. The boss had it there for the cattle, and when he caught them drinking water there, he got angry. He didn't much like the idea of their losing time going to drink water because they weren't on contract, but by the hour. He told them that if he caught them there again, he was going to fire them and not pay them. The children were the ones who couldn't wait. I'm very thirsty, Dad. Is the boss going to be here soon? Yo creo que sí. Ya no te aguantas. Well, I don't know. My throat already feels real dry. Do you think he's almost going to be here? Should I go to the tank? No, espérate un ratito más. Ya viste lo que dijo. No, I, I know that he'll fire us if he catches us there, but I can't wait. Ya, ya, trabajale, ahorita viene. Well, I'll try it away. Why doesn't this one let us bring water? Up north, porque es un arrastrado. But we could hide it under the sea, couldn't we? It was always better up north. And what if I make like I'm going to go relieve myself by the tank? And this was what they started doing that afternoon. They pretended they were going to relieve themselves and they would go on to the edge of the tank. The boss became aware of this almost right away, but he didn't let on. He wanted to catch a bunch of them and that way he could pay fewer of them and only after they had done more work. He noticed that one of the children kept going to drink water every little while, and he became more and more furious. He thought then of giving him a scare and crawled on the ground to get his rifle. What he set out to do and what he did were two different things. He shot at him once to scare him, but when he pulled the trigger, he saw the boy with a hole in his head. And the child didn't even jump like a deer does. He just stayed in the water like a dirty rag and the water began to turn bloody. They say the old man almost went crazy. You think so? Yes. He's already lost the ranch. He hit the bottle pretty hard. And then after they tried him and he got off free, they say he jumped off a tree because he wanted to kill himself. But he didn't kill himself, did he? Well, no. Well, then there you have it. Well, I'll tell you, compadre, I think he did go crazy. You've seen the likes of him nowadays? He looks like a beggar. Sure. That's because he doesn't have any more money. Well, uh, that's true. <laughs> 